In this video, I'll show you the 3D camera tracking. First, bring all videos to After Effects. Select the background footage and create a new composition with it. The footage is high resolution and has good contrast and that helps the tracking. With the layer selected, go to the top menu, Animation, Track Camera. It will take a few minutes for the program to analyze the video and to create the tracking points. Once it is done, you'll see the colorful dots been added to the environment. Find a spot where you would like to place your character. Grab more than three points. Right click. Create null in camera. It will create a 3D camera to simulate the camera movement and will create a null object to stay on the spot. Bring in the character footage. Use Keylight 1.2 to get rid of the green background. By default, the layer's anchor point stays in the center of the video. The rotation and position of the layer are based on the anchor point. Use the anchor point tool to move the anchor point to the character's foot. That way, the layer's position is based on the character's foot. The track camera we applied earlier turned the background footage to a 3D space. To place the character in the 3D space, we need to change the layer to a 3D layer. If you can't find it, right-click on the columns and check on the switches. To place the character on the same spot as the null object, their position values should be the same. Select both layers and hit the P key to display the layer's position channel. By increase the character's Z value, we are shifting the character towards the null object. To place the character on the exact spot where the null object is, you can copy the null object's position XYZ values to the character. Hold the command key and hit the C key to copy. Hold the command key and hit the V key to paste. Now the character should stay right there. Let's place a sinkhole in front of the robot. To show the tracking point, go to the background layer and select the 3D camera tracker we applied earlier. Whenever you deselected the effect, the tracking point is hidden. Grab more than three tracking points at where you would like to place the sinkhole or any other footages. Right-click and create Null. We've created a camera at the beginning, so the menu is different this time. Select the second Null object you created and you may rename it by hitting the Enter key. Bring in the sinkhole footage and get rid of the green background.
Use the anchor point tool to move the anchor point onto the sinkhole. Then, switch the layer to a 3D layer. Select the second null object in the sinkhole footage, hit the P key to display the layer's position channel. Copy the null object's position XYZ to the sinkhole layer. Now, the sinkhole should be placed at the right spot. If you'd like to place more characters or effects on the background, repeat this procedure. 